Hello and welcome to Inktober Day 6. I'm Fuchsanz or Lilith and I'm glad you're here. Today's prompt was Spirit and I've used the Inktober prompt list for this because it felt a little bit better to do than my usual prompt list. And I thought about what I wanted to draw, like Spirit could be a lot of different things. And I've been watching a lot of um, Dead by Daylight streams by The Clur. You can check him out on Twitch and I think he's on YouTube too. I can link him down below because I really enjoy his streams. And um, the spirit is a killer on Dead by Daylight. <laughs> and I think either you really like her or you hate her. It's very difficult to play against her. But I really like her design so for this prompt I decided to draw her in her kimono skin which I had so much trouble finding reference pictures for. So if it's inaccurate at all I'm very sorry but there wasn't any good references for me to get a detail of the kimono or um, for her hair. That's a bit frustrating, but hey, I think it turned out okay regardless of if it's accurate or not. I felt like especially with this piece it was a lot of line work and just me using my fountain pen to do all the line art for this.
I feel like uh, adding the line art to every strand of hair was a bit unnecessary because I end up covering it up with some light grey in the end but here you can see me just adding all the lines it was meditative but as I said it was a bit unnecessary <laughs> Here's the part where I was using my brush pen to fill in the hair because I felt like it lacked some depth or contrast in comparison to the rest and the spirit has dark hair so I felt it was necessary to add the grey. And I wasn't quite sure how I was going to go about uh, the kimono and the pattern because it was so intricate and I didn't have a good reference. But I think I did okay. I um, sketched in the pattern that I wanted to do and the um, pattern motives I guess. I left out when I uh, used the brush pen so I could do some line art and detail with another pen. Basically I was filling in all the fabric that didn't have any pattern on it with the brush pen.
And here's where the tedious work of adding the patterns or the line work for the pattern of the kimono started. I try to get in as much detail as I can or make it as accurate as possible and I think it turned out alright. I really want to get better with patterns and stock up my mental library for it. Uh, it's really something I'm not used to and I'm trying to get better at it with time and I hope this challenge will help me to get in more practice for my pattern making. Usually I wouldn't add a background, but because it's such a creepy theme for the spirit, I decided to get my brush pen out that was a little bit dry um, to add some sort of texture, which you can see me add later. I really liked the effect that the brush pen gave it because it was so dry, it just looked a bit distressed and that's the effect I was going for. Maybe I could have added it in with digital media because scanning it and all that made me not like it as much, but that's alright. The final touch was adding some liquid chrome with my Molotow marker and then I was basically done. So I hope you enjoyed this illustration again and I hope you're doing well with your own Inktober if you're doing it. You can comment and like if you want or subscribe and I'll see you next time and bye!